Hey, this is Brad from Macklin Ford making a quick video walk around on our 2024 Ford Bronco Raptor that we have in stock. This thing just landed on Saturday and it looks really cool. It's in hot pepper red metallic with the black appearance package on it. And on the Raptor, you get these massive fender flares, side fender vents, and 37 inch BF Goodrich KO2 tires with a beadlock capable rim. Down below here, we got the Raptor style metal running boards, which are nice and powder coated so you don't slip on those. And uh, yeah, this thing's pretty good. So the blackout package, Gives you a cool blacked out hood, gloss black mirrors, and a painted hardtop, which looks pretty sweet with that two-tone contrast. And coming around to the back, this thing is chunky. Looking good on the back here. We got a tow package, rear parking sensors, full-size trailer, sorry, full-size spare tire with our backup camera, Raptor badge there, and signature Raptor tail lights. You can open up the rear hatch like so. Open up the glass, and now you have tons of room to access the back. With the Raptor, you get this cool extra strut brace to have better handling support. It comes with the bags for when you take the doors off in the summertime and rubber mats all around. And then these ones here are bags for the roof panels. In the back, you also get upgraded sound system with a subwoofer there. And they did put a bottle opener on the inside as well. But we'll close this thing up. Cool little Raptor badge on the back of that, which I just noticed looks pretty cool. This thing is... Uh, Looks pretty tough, very aggressive look. So we'll head around to this side here. You can see we got the upgraded Fox shocks in the back. Open up the rear door here. You get the code orange stitching in the seats, which is special to the Raptor. And up front, you also get another strut tower brace in the middle for that extra stability. You can click this lever down to drop down the seats if you need a bit more storage to the back. And then coming up front, you're gonna have keyless entry, blind zone monitors. And my favorite part of the, about the Raptors is that you have these cool side marker lights. Just because it's so wide, you have to have those extra clearance lights on this thing. So up front, you're gonna get those signature Raptor orange headlights with those three light bars in the grill as well. This thing looks pretty aggressive. You get a modular bumper up front with built-in rigid LED pod lights and you can take off that cover there for another pod light setup. But yeah, this thing looks really cool. You can remote start it from an app on your phone or from the key fob here and get that three liter twin turbo V6 started up. Let's hop inside here. So inside you got a fully adjustable power driver seat. Kind of hard to see, but you do have some nice special Raptor seats under the plastics here and a Ford Performance badge on the door sill. Inside, you get lots of carbon fiber from your steering wheel to all that good stuff. It's cold there today, holy. But anyways, nice sporty steering wheel with paddle shifters built in. Kind of a red arrow at the top there and a fully digital dash. My favorite part about the Raptor though is probably the customizable exhaust modes. So you can do a normal, sport, Baja mode or quiet and also change your suspension for whatever kind of conditions you're in. Over here, nice big touchscreen display with wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, wireless phone charger down below and heated seats and a heated steering wheel. Up top are your hero buttons, so you can have front and rear locking differentials, the sway bar disconnect, uh, the trail control, traction control, all that fun stuff. And there's even a mount for a GoPro here if you're gonna do some off-roading, and you can uh, plug in your phone or GoPro down there to stay connected. Up top here, you have the auxiliary switches if it's, so it's like pre-wired if you wanna add light bars or winches or anything like that. And of course, you have the nice removable hard top, as you can see up top. Down below here, you have all your four-wheel drive controls with an automatic four-wheel drive, which is kind of like all-wheel drive. And then you can turn that dial for like Baja mode, rock crawl, off-road, and sport mode, tow haul, and slippery, which is great for days like today with all the ice and snow we have after that dumping. But overall, this thing's in really good condition. And if it looks like the right option for you, give me a buzz at 403-993-3056. I think I do have some other colors available as well if you're not a fan of the hot pepper, but overall, it's a pretty sweet ride. Thanks for watching this quick video. I'm Brad Macklin Ford. We'll see you soon.